What's up YouTube? Your boy back here once again with another sport topic. And today we're going to continue to talk about the NBA draft. We're going to enter the fourth pick in the draft, which is the Phoenix Suns. And with the fourth pick in the draft, the Phoenix Suns selected Josh Jackson, who, in my opinion, possibly, more than likely, is the second best player in the draft. So for one, you get him at great value. And uh, <clears throat> now those are um, issues with his jump shot. But that's why I think this is a good fit for him because you're going to have two wing players with him and Booker. Booker going to bring that offense. Josh going to lock him on de defense. And he has that dog mentality, I'm going to lock you down. Like, he can't wait to lock somebody down. They say he has that first one in, last one out. Like, he a gym rat, all that nice, fine, good stuff. I know Stephen, they said his attitude's compared to Kobe. Um, the talks from when I heard him talk, he sounds like he that guy. Like, he's that guy who really wants to compete. And, hey, why would you want somebody who wants to compete? Like, he wants to compete. He's not shying away from competition. I like that about him. You know, some people, superstars, talent-wise, they want if they brought easy to them. They want to be served with, uh, served with a, silver, a silver spoon in their mouth. He look like he want to fight for his. And I like that. But it all like says issues with his jump shot. And hopefully, you know, Devin Bug can help him with that. And you know, he, you know, he gonna have to, if he be a gym rat like they say he is, he needs to stay in that gym and work on the jump shot. It's been some character concerns though. I think that would probably be the most alarming. They said some issues with other stuff, but like more about the company he keeps. Basically, he's hanging with the wrong people. Like, and I'm gonna give some advice to people out there. If you have a certain talent when it comes to music. Sports, especially if you're dealing with people in the hood, like talents drawing, talents building. You have a special type of talents. Don't let your hood bring you down. Don't try to continue to be like, hey, I'm a rep for the hood and I'm going to keep it 100. Because at the end of the day, if you don't make it and you stay a hood person, they ain't helping you pay your bills, bro. Be honest with you. Them dudes that you hanging with, you want to keep 100 with, same dudes going to knock down your girl. Same dudes that you with out in the club and you talking to somebody and they'll go tell your girl that you do, that you talking, you was talking to this chick. I'm just getting, spit some realness to y'all. I mean, like, be careful who you keep it 100 with because not everybody going to keep it 100 with you. But other than that, like, I'm going to get off that back to Josh and his basketball situation. Like, so that that's it's more about, it's not really more about him. It's more about the company to keep. You know, he has some issues that he vandalized an ex-girlfriend's car. That was, all right, I'm going to put it to you. That's straight dumb and stupid. And I said this when they, when uh, Joe Mixon was drafted. And then there was another NFL player that was drafted who I think was, something happened like a couple of days before the, the NFL draft. I'm like, they making these athletes dumber and dumber. Like, you are in a position to set yourself up for life. Especially when it comes to the NBA. Like, NBA has guaranteed contracts. People out here getting, that don't deserve it, $130 million contracts. And y'all here doing foolish stuff. Like, y'all not, y'all, it's not like y'all got hurt. Some of y'all couldn't help. Y'all here doing stupid like unforced errors, y'all doing stuff to yourself, vandalizing people's cars, hitting on people, going places you shouldn't be going, messing around with people you shouldn't be messing around with. Like, come on now, come on, come on, come on. Keep your mind on the prize and set yourself up in a good way. Don't do none of that stupid stuff. So, outside of that character issue, as far as we gonna talk about talent, I think he's the second best talent in. The draft because he's able to lock that he's a lockdown defender and then the attitude as far as I got the dog in him and you can't that stuff you can't teach that stuff either you have or you don't like either you have hard or you don't you can't teach that stuff and you don't want to lose that because even if you don't have the physical talents you have enough heart it can make up for some of them physical talents because you want it more you want it better so we're going to see about Phoenix I'm gonna be a team to keep my eye on with him and Devin Book on the wings. I, I, I'm keep my eye on, on the Phoenix Suns. I think y'all should too. Um, I like the pickup for them, like I said, because to my opinion, he's the second best player talent wise in the draft, and they got him at the fourth overall pick. So, 
Um, like, share, subscribe if you haven't. Comment below if you haven't. Click that bell to get more videos. I do this every day, dropping videos every day. If not, I drop two or three a day. And that's just how I roll. I'm out here trying to grind, trying to get it. Um, like I said, trying to get, I want y'all to participate. If y'all want to, I do debates. If you want to come in, like, like if you want to call in and just actually just rant. Your team did something you didn't like. You just want to rant it. You want to debate me and some of my opinions. You think my opinions are stupid. Whatever. I got love. Whatever you want to do. If you just want to have a specific topic you want to talk to me about. Hey, you have to be a subscriber. Then comment below and tell me. Let me know what you want to do, and I set it up, and we can get it on. We uh, we we can get we we can we can get we can get it going. And if you want me to do a specific topic, like night that you want to be on one, but you want me to do a specific topic, if you want me to say what happened to the 2012 Thunder, why they didn't win a title, type of stuff. Like I do stuff like that. If you want me to do a projection on what other people are gonna do in the draft or years to come, or future prospect, what happened to this prospect, why why this prospect never did anything, just let me know, comment below and I'll do it. I'll let you.